Mon ti connaît mon abri en chemin c'est qui t'aime ou ta fou. Mon qui peut goûter à quoi ta quoi ta ou bien t'es dans la commune ministre. A te yon te shima jon yon leta. A ba rekordi a mou kota an shebi. So da ta yon ti ou simbi a le lan fwa ni la ti wou. A yon va ti pou bwen yon te mouwi ta mouwi pe e ba e ba ni di mou information ni kwa papa ti Dubai. Ou bwen yon te jek pe e ma le pas se si bo gwa wun re wa mi. Pe bo gwa la ni opportunity la ti la papa ti ni Dubai. Bo gwa advantage to wani nou ke yon ni papa ti ni lwi nye. Yon koto fi da a nou ta le gwa invest yon wo wa. Ishe e do tu tu. Ishe nou wala, i nou jo, ta an she. Ba she le she, to le fi di nkan kou pof nou wala la. Oun la she mi ka yon gaiti, nou ba ta re information yon ke yon nou wala. Ke wala bo, kompi mi ji ni a basoro le ni, a ti ben ni konstoro lo re di to jeta gas property. A wun ni ke di ta fe basoro la ti e mas property. A mi je di ta an soro e ta kwe wala si bi yi le ni. A ti lo se on wala, a ti li bi pe yes, wun ni a wun koto, da to de ma wulo fu wala wala. A de fe kon espe ni fun waba she le ya shi ve, oun la she invite mo wala. So, you can see the report, you can go and be a lot of loss, so you can go and be a lot of money, you can go and lay. Ah, they will pass the wrong information for you, you can see the money. So, you can see the money, you can see the money, you can see the money. And for you, you can see the money, 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 you can see the money. So, you can see the money, yes, they have a lot, so they share the money. So, I can see the money, you can see the money, you can see the money. So you can see that you can see mistake in time to move forward. You know, messages you want to move forward. Yes, I can see that. Yes, I can see that. Yes, I can see that. I want to see that you can 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 see that. Sister Ijuru, Ijuru, I wish I could pronounce your name, Dada. Oh, that's what you mean, Tara. You. Ah, Goyi. I pronounce your name, Dada. Yes. Yeah. Eh, mo, I go you baje wa tajo mo you baje on so we are happy to see that. Thank you. Thank you. So, move back. Move back. We tap on the ah. So we can march along. We go to the concert. We turn up. Oh, but that was a poor poor. You know, I'm quite there. So, listen. I want you all to meet Billy tomorrow. Billy, why? I'm going to let Billy in. Billy, why? Emma, so be she just for what? Number two. I come for any advantages. Property and barra properties. Ni ilute why? So that number one is Billy. Why Billy? Because I'm going to book Billy. You know, book Billy. You know. So, be she. Okay, we well, call everybody, but English ni mo maso because. Eh, uh, do we know that we are okay with you. So good evening, everybody. My name is um Ejira, and I've been in Dubai for eight years. I'm an associate director, and um, I want to talk to you guys about MR. MR Properties is the biggest um, developer in the Middle East and in North Africa. Uh, they have, if you've been to Dubai, you'd have heard about Dubai Mall, Burj Khalifa. Burj, Burj Khalifa is the tallest tower in the whole world. It is built by MR. Dubai Mall is the largest shopping mall in the world. It is built by MR. MR is always trying to do the largest this, the largest that, the tallest this in the whole world. So MR sells luxury. In Dubai here, any property that is from MR has to do with luxury. And they Flexibility in their payment plans as well. Due to this market from last year, a lot of things were changed. So payment plan was also adjusted according to what's going on in the world right now. So the flexibility is there also in the payment plan, both for the properties that are ready and the properties that are under construction. In Dubai here, we have two types of properties. We have the ones that are under construction, which usually comes cheaper when it's under construction and you're paying according to the milestone. When I say milestone, it means as they are building and every percentage of building, every percent it gets to every level, your payment plan is, 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 is um, drafted out that way. So that's for off plan. Then for ready, it means that it is ready for immediate occupancy. And even with that, sometimes on some, we have 
payment plan as well. We have some certain percentage you drop and then the remaining percentage over some certain years you have to pay. Meanwhile, in that same time, you collected your key, you have your tenants in the apartment, you're collecting your rent, you're adding from your pocket a little bit and you're making your installments in payment. Uh, so those are the kind of categories we have. And then in, in UAE and in Dubai generally, we have the freehold and we have the non-freehold. If you buy in the freehold, it means the property belongs to you forever. You can, your family can inherit, you can sell, you can do anything. If you buy in the leasehold, which is more for the locals, you only get it on lease base, which is for 99%. So most times for foreigners, we don't buy in the leasehold area, we buy in the freehold area. So everything that we sell to you guys are uh, in the freehold. So you buy something that is from the freehold area when you own it 100%, you can, the, your people can inherit, you can sell and whatever you want to do with it. So we've got different, we've got different properties. We have properties that has beach front access on the beach. We have properties that have golf course. If you want, if you're a golf lover, you want to have something on the golf course, we've got properties like that. We've got properties starting from one bedroom up until seven bedrooms, depends on what a client is looking for. We've got small and medium and then large properties. And also we've got payments, we've got prices starting from $250,000 up until infinity, depends on what a client is looking for. And usually when I'm talking about these properties, I always like people to ask me questions because when you ask me questions, I'll be able to talk according to you. Because like I said, Mari is very big. We've got too many projects. I cannot start talking about all the projects. That is why I talked about the different communities. We have the beachfront community. We've got the, there's, uh, the, there's a project called the Emma Bridge Front. And on the beach front, we have different apartments from one to four bedrooms. Now we've got Dubai Hills. Dubai Hills is both a park community and a golf course community. And on this, we've got one bedrooms up until seven bedrooms, depends on what a client is looking for. For the apartments, it starts from one bedroom to four bedrooms. Then we've got villas and townhouses. Villas we've got from three bedrooms up until seven bedrooms. Hmm. So you mentioned about apartments and uh, beach fronts. Yeah, apartments on the beach front. We have apartments, one bedroom to four bedrooms. We've got penthouses on the beach front, but those ones are all skyscrapers. We've got only skyscrapers there. Then we've got downtown Dubai. Downtown Dubai is where you have Burj Khalifa, you have Dubai Mall. And in those places, we've only got skyscrapers as well and one to four bedroom apartments, also penthouses. Hmm. That means you have everything. Everything, <laughs> everything. So uh, let me just say it in yoga to my people that we are here now. I know you understand yoga very well. And in Taiwan, you know, let me be in Emma's property, Tans or Unquay, they have everything. Because think of the fair TA on, if I in Wajadi. But the issue to one, you know, or a property in Dubai, to figure out to sit in Nigeria and you'll be quick. Nick Batabas saw budget in normal log bay and one cut off four. See what any lower, you know, my local book where Jadi Funy, Emma go through it, Emma one way to ban wing. Because they have many. Timas or equipment, especially MRC, only Lorishi Rishi, a bottom dark apartment, beach front, Kiniko, a Dubai Mock, Kinik Opo, once in Opo, Juro, and Walasha. So, Niti and Bafera Lady, okay, I would say if you are maybe, can you just mention the smallest amount? So, Yepo, what now? Can you just tell us about that? Okay, um, the smallest amount, to what I'm missing is. In the local currency, we have it like 700,000, but it's cash, could this payment plan? And that is like uh, about $200,000. About 200,000, okay, Reju. Yes. No, in one, one room is a one bedroom apartment. So one bedroom apartment, Nibi buy only guest toilets, then Omani living area, Omani open kitchen, then Omani bedroom, then any small balcony. From two hundred thousand dollars. From two hundred thousand dollars. Hmm. She furnish one bedara. 
No, kosi furniture. Kosi furniture on bear. Hey, it's a Japanese pants in B. Lenny. Emma's property, no one be off from you buy. Sabar anybody to need anything, Latin more. Nick a property more, but any berry, Latin berry. Every free Latin berry, lower money thing. Kale, only shall I find that that to repeat the Bambi Low Jacari Bonico. Only ma more right answer that that the safety she know that is of me, but a mama contact you want for me reply to need. A more cut to the crown anybody, Billy, Billy, and to my baby, Billy, she free, that's the every free Latin burial. A more cut to the crown anybody say, Well, so anything now. Advantage you will know one in no can you rap property in Dubai. Only okay. only Jake and contain your lady. Be your fair investing, you coffee mine as an investor near being your fake baby. Any kill advantage and look one day into one better petty way. I won't put say like Jay and I want a femo. Okay, in Cotto, I mean, you pay me Dubai. Dubai is a tax free economy, there is no tax on anything. We only have VAT, which is on services and on the things you buy for your grocery or all that. But on properties, it's zero tax. You don't have any tax on your income. Any amount, tobagba as rent, now there's a one-time payment, which is 4%. So think about it, 4% overall, total. Four percent full as or what documents so paper and a paper any title deed. So anytime TNI ever said that property in your father, title deed in a man loaf it at property. Ah, ah, then it's a property in your Torah property or Batty Simbi by because of money that Simu original copy title deed there were Tamafita. So ah, let a property in you, Lenny and in you. Uh -huh. mm. That's one thing. Then another thing, everything is open. Kosi, secret, anything. But when come open, then another thing. Kosi, we in your property in Dubai. Omania, Oruko, any on law, Nigeria. You pay any buy buy any property, any be any kosi. Go control job. If there is confidentiality in whatever you buy, yes. So there is no. Your name here and there that you have a property here or you don't have it. No matter the amount of property you buy, nothing is exposed about you and your property. Then also here, as we all know right now, UAE is ranking number one safest country mm -hmm. in the world, and Abu Dhabi is number one. Dubai is number six right now in the whole world. So in your lead, any three a.m. Oh, be really jai de wo ni be rupe yon hara so be re a be in konshele a bo jag bag ba ko sin ko konbenye and if you go to the mall you make maybe you forget your personal item somewhere if you go back there you will get it so this place is very safe hundred percent it is a good place to raise children as well see i want your top of shop because ni ngbati covid he there i want your people where they see my locate where we buy all the way there's a lot of laws nibi by to jackie if you buy you go save even fun i want more Call it moon and call it raise and one more, maybe by. So, Dubai is a place that anybody can live, both single people, married people, family, and every community. Toba Nini Dubai. See, about it be for a man, you see. A man cooking just, Koni call Ilekon, I feel a bang. A man call community. Oh, my knee be town on one sherry. Oh, my knee hospital, Nibe. Oh, my knee school, Nibe. Or money mall in no community. So then cotton your buffet she within your community, you don't need to go anywhere. Everything you want is there. There are offices, homes, there are um, hotels around, you have um, schools around, you have malls. So it's like everything that Emma builds is always a, a, a city inside a city. So if you come, the, the square meter is always so huge that, you know, so that everything can be inside. All the amenities that you think about that a place needs to have for people to be comfortable to live inside is always there. A man makes sure that everything is there. Well, you won't call it, and you come by. Oh, my, okay. I'm okay. I want to develop a KKK. Oh, my, call it. Oh, my, feel it. Oh, my, call 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 it. Oh, my
but Emma is not like that. Emma builds for community. So you are in a community living, which is better for everybody's mental health, other than, you know, and any community, Bobo community in Emma, Nicolo, Mani, Kinshope, Emma, Macaulay, and Yomi, our college, no. They, any place you see that belongs to Emma, the whole of the community is only them that builds it. So there's a uniformity in the building. And then the, um, the maintenance is always top notch. If you come to Dubai, you look at what Emma has built the past 10 years, you will see that the structure of the building is still very beautiful. The maintenance level is, the community is super, super amazing. Compared to, and when you're talking about Koile, maintenance well, over years is not always as, as good as somebody who is handling a whole community. Hmm. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Moria won community ni mo la won bi kan ta wo ti mo ri pe eh o la gbara die very yeah. beautiful mo understand go e ti mu city inside city ni yes. <laughs> city inside like city. Uh, like dubai hills in sin dubai hills is a city inside the city because you've got the mall there it's a big mall yeah. you've, got, you've got three international schools inside the community you've got kings 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 hospital you've got kings hospital the london one inside the community. And then also there are other, other things, a very massive big park. There is green, so much of greenery. There is the community pool. Too many amenities are there, so many. Hmm. So what you're paying, what you're paying for your, is your value for money that you're receiving. Okay. Uh, why Timo Shinsaw? Why Timo? Sorry, Emma. Why Timo Shinsaw? Me only share anything because Timo Bafe share the files are usually big. I can only share our files in Lori Zoom because Oman yeah. too. So mm -hmm. anybody to about is okay. More like a me man like a little bow or me. To about is okay. Okay, I'm a mope any year. I'm a funny. Nkotowani beachfront. This mm -hmm. beachfront is still under construction, but some of the apartments will be handing over this year towards the end of the year. In yes, I marry one bedroom more, one bedroom or two bedroom or three bedroom in Shiliwa. So I let's okay, tea and yeah, you know, more fan yet see or my ready lodging, lodging, I one in I want yet to buy what I believe I'm a sense more. But I'm not okay. Me or mind, more they draw two years, more they draw three years. I'm a funny, you know, something that is coming up soon. Construction is ongoing and everything. And that way we'll be able to narrow down what, because see, if we say, let's give you this, let's explain this, people will get confused because it's too many. So we have to narrow it down. So after a meeting, see, then you'll come back by and say, okay, me for one bedroom, but me like a cotton wool, me, I'm a mokweni yi. Eja kafuni beachfront. Eh, yon mi le sokwe ah, e mi fe ki le yon ko ma wo tallest building no, so that toba tin she, eh, ma kwe 31st night, eh, kwe New Year Eve. O da kwe bo kwa yelo ma wa si du bai fun New Year Eve, yeah. So, a wwa yi le to wwa ni bi, to wwa ni sa di biti Burj Khalifa a wwa yen, a wwa le yon ma wwa gwa, o da ma mo wo da da wwa fun investment. So, ta wwa yon mi ba sokwe ke, e mi fe ki, e le ti mo ni, ko ma wo, Watch Khalifa, and yeah, I'm okay downtown. I'm a gay, and you can see, but the only thing is that it's a bit pricey, it's more expensive. But you know, so every client in the important one fair, you understand professionally. A minimum, my advice on it, okay, hello, you can take this place, or you can go for this part, or you can go for this. But until you get to speak with the client and you understand where the client is coming from, before you'll be able to professionally give your advice on what a client should buy or not. That's if a client who wants to depend on you for professional advice, then you can say, okay, from professional professionally, and if you want this kind of um, um, return on investment, let's go for this property. So it all depends. Cause Nisi, you know, I'm just trying to give an overview you know, like an introduction into what it is in having a property in Dubai and having a property with Emma, you know, so it's like an introduction. But going into the properties, we need to know exactly what a client's requirement is, what a client wants, and then we can give as per our own advice and our own um, professionalism, we can be able to give the client what the client wants. Okay. 
At the end of the day, and why little barra most likely drink it and drop it. Huh? I'm going here, Master Rolling. Okay, so most likely, I want to hear Tora. I don't know. Maybe the person that they bought from, she might be going by me. Papa Laura, he let Laura. I want to go and buy me. I want to go and buy. We go here, King. We all go anybody because Timo is normal to them. To them, it's not a big deal that. This person is my client. I can name it. But she must be a wa at the mobile thirteen box. Oh, she did a wa. Eh, so I the worry your concern. Time basor. Cause of me, when you buy buy, rally lower me. When you no. Generally in Dubai, there's a confidentiality, even as a real talk. Taban she coswa. It is part of it that you never mention the name of who your clients are anywhere. So there's that confidentiality that is there. It's only that, okay, yes, sometimes there are some exceptions. I'm sure which was the case of that one. Hmm. We complete, uh, like how many percentage? Okay. Of the person who is ready to make a phone call? Okay. Offer that you listen. There is 25%. You pay 25% or my phone in your call. 75% of the people who are ready to make a Tell what is on twenty five percent on my phone on the key. Yes, so much is on twenty five percent in your Yamaga or Oil. Then seventy five percent to cook at the automatic office. But one bedroom will see me offer you. It's two bedrooms and above. Hmm. Oh, the uh, there can be a more information that is born in a can you proceed on cutting your machine? Can you be already last year? Anything? Mu de fera la ra iteti koto mu de fera iteti gba koko ro. Kila on koti mu godo she. Ti mu fi machine. She wo ni konye no ni ti ma ti son four percent mu de ti son twenty five percent. There is nothing again. Ti mu ni di last year she. Okay, this thing to one be ni koye she mu ti in your bani okay. Eh, okay. After this meeting, in your phone contact, in okay mu fe. Ra two bedroom is totally ready. I'm a for any any different options. Need two bedroom totally ready, different prices. Any about choosing a two fair. So by fair was he do buy only work over for jewelry. To buy the few when you because I'm at it telephone and when you're cooked, but see what was he be by and got a commercial in the way. I'm a live viewing. Timba, I'm a fixed time. Everybody, I want to read one while you read computer. A young one with a computer. A me no ma one be. I will go and we will do a live viewing of the environment, of the apartment, of the facilities, the amenities, everything. Yes, I like it. Taba to say yes, I like it. Oh ma, I need that to block it. Taba in cotton meaning of blocking it way. Oh ma, I need that to send you owo online. Kinsha wagon. They will generate a link. They will send you the link. Once they send you the link, you pay the amount. And then it is blocked for you as your property, which is just 10% initially. Or sometimes you can even put any amount just to block it and say, okay, I want to block this and come to Dubai. So you okay. have a certain period to block and then come to Dubai and then we'll show you and then you finalize your, 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 your stock. Or you can stay over there. A lot of people in Canada have bought properties from me this way. They, they, they are not here. They didn't come. We did the live viewing. After the live viewing, we go back to the office. We sit down. Yes, I like this unit. We show the floor plan online. Everything we show you. We send you the brochure. Send you everything. Every information you need, you get to see it. You see the <clears throat> apartment itself, even in the video, the 360 views, everything. You say, yes, I want it. And then they send you the credit card authorization form. Once they send credit card authorization form, you feel it. Send it back, scan copy. Then they will deduct that money from your credit card. Once they deduct the money from your credit card, they send you the receipts online and then they send you the form you need to fill as the owner. Once that form, that form is called the offer to purchase. Once you fill the offer to purchase, you sign it, you scan it back. After seeing it back today, then your unit is given to you. What they now do is they send you sales purchase agreement. Sales purchase agreement, yeah, it will buy you. So, Omawa um, saying the true Korea, 
si any any be keep it any bawa. Our sign bo bo page se a sign our da father. Toba ti da father. Then our need that is one. Toba je fifteen percent. Toba je um twenty five percent of any loni. Our son twenty five percent toku. Toba je son twenty five percent toku. Our agba kokoro. Then hmm. payment plan man wa. I gem maybe ten percent every three months or ten percent every six months. Depends on which project the person gets. That's what determines how we do the payment plan. But the payment plan is stipulated. It doesn't change. The same with offering you should pay maybe next year. Oh my you pay no. It change. But payment plan, yeah. But continue at some what T T D. For example, we have dollar, dollar rice, be dollar shaking you from nothing. But she what? But she buy payment, yeah. To buy in the next three years. To buy one dollar for last year, is all. To buy one for one year, payment plan. But she we, but she must on when, yeah. But I want developers in me. I want developers in me. Payment plan. Think about that payment plan. See, or do you need to know about money? Think about that payment. I'm on my knee. Difference between mm -hmm. cash. They have a difference of I want to pay cash and I want to use payment plan. If you want to use payment plan, it's like taking a loan from the bank, but there is no, it's like taking a loan from the bank. They will put their interest on it. But Emma is not putting in any interest. The amount that Emma has given you. That's the amount you're getting throughout till your payment is over. Hmm. Eh she, you know, I don't know how to go in. We could say, you see, dollar rice, dollar fall, dollar sugar, dollar DD. Because it's okay, we could do more agreement is agreement, which is very good. Yeah. Uh, me, as you want rent, you lay out, tell you about it's some percentage, tell you it's some four percent, tell you she go go document signing everything. At your age, to my bank, you buy to my rent. Lay in how easy it is. Okay, for renting, I want to lash my father buying rent. So there's no, you don't have any headache on how your house is going to be rented. We are the ones that will rent it for you. I will usually profile the client before we do your renting, so you don't have any issues about whether your house is going to get rented or it's not going to get rented. One thing I need to emphasize on is anywhere you're buying a property, location matters. Location is very important in decision making for property. See, you buy lawful property cons. Don't you wear hundred and fifty thousand dollars? Okay, Laura, into real one year. Oje one fifty. A media phone you property to je two fifty. Now you are top property wa location one new. I want clients to my wo elite. Me ya to say I want clients to my wo elite to wa cheaper. So in yon le ni headache lor la. So yeah. Meanwhile, for this one, we profile our clients before we put tenants in your apartment. And they kind of just like missing. Let me give you an example with I don't know maybe Banana Island and. Somebody who is living on the island. Now, if you're living on the island, there is a different class of people that are there. And there's a different class of people that are somewhere else. There is a difference. The people who are on the island, I'm sure they are paying more for rent than some people who are in other places. So now, you know, before you can stay on the island, it means that you're earning a good salary for you to be able to live there. You understand? So that's how it is. In these places, people who are living in this kind of places are people who are good earners, working in nice companies that will not default on on on, on paying of rent. Hmm. So it's a that, different class. Well, I'm going to be very, very funny. Very, very. Share and read our questions, Tom. Very. And Tony, can you please tell us the prices of the properties, especially those in downtown Dubai? Okay. Yeah. Um, downtown Dubai, like um, downtown Dubai, as I said, is quite pricey. One bedroom in downtown could be as much as, uh, let me say 2 million dirhams. Let's say 1.8 million dirhams. So let's um, say from between 600, 650, $700,000 we are able to get in downtown, let's say starting price. And like I said also, the floor determines what price if the apartment is overlooking Burj Khalifa. Because <clears throat> there is Burj Khalifa, 
And then there is the fountain. And when you talk about what you do by oh man more fountain, fountain ni omi to man joy. Ehhe. <laughs> So, oh, where am I at? So, let's say from 600000 700000 dollars, we are likely to get one bedroom apartment in downtown Dubai. And then hmm. somebody asked, What is the standard payment plan for your properties generally? You mentioned a current offer of 25 down and 75% over three years. Do you charge for managing a rental property? Okay, I'll tell you, standard payment usually is 50 50. <coughs> You pay 50% during construction, 50% bulk payment to take your house, or 50% during construction, 50% two years post handover. That's 50%. After you take the keys, you have two years to pay 50%. That's the standard payment plan. And do you charge for managing a rental property? I don't do managing of your rental property. I will only get you a tenant that will stay in your property for one year. But if you're looking to put your property under the holiday home scheme, which is the short-term rent, okay? Those ones that are from companies in Dubai that are managing those kind of properties, I think what they do is they take 10% and the rest comes to you. Hmm. They, they, they always collect 10% from the payments. Yes, ten percent from the payment. They do everything. T -t guess, and so, but I by managing, to by managing, is it possible? No, seeing your budget by managing. No, me go your mafi tenancy long term. Okay. They only initiate short term rent. Your mafi tenant long term. Long term tenant a while la mafi fi tenancy beni. Hmm. They on tobara. But seeing your budget she short term. So short term, hmm. anybody about should be holiday home, short term. Hmm. So that's okay, let me know. Then it and tell me not about what you do by more federal cyber, Zimbabwe, Kuro, Kogbuk, but that's only rent in here. Only companies to want to buy me by Tom and Handule. I want to hmm. manage holiday homes. Why Tom and Bab percentage any way? See tenants, he bad jaddy. On my look, on my saying, I'm a clean, on my change, every hotel, ni on my change, everything, share everything, and everything gone on my own online. He between your joko anywhere in the world, you will check online, you will see when somebody came into your apartment, when somebody left, how much was paid. So you know that there is no cheating because it's online, you're seeing it. You okay. get it. so that's hmm. how it. But the fact of a low wound by that is only a rally major meta can you take before to my man say me? I come up power lane. Yes, who got the name of my reader online? Oh, you don't have that. Just about my place on your application. So just be okay in just because and you know, and I need it. At if he maybe a money pay okay one week, ni uh, April 10th to April 20th, Mama, I need Dubai. So period, yeah, go one man, make sure pay. Because anybody to my wa because they internally and my wife just see so the back to one move eh uh, yeah so you are monitoring you will see the times that people are in your apartment and the times that your apartment is empty or the time that somebody moved out and somebody came in how much it was paid because they will tell you and you will even be seeing it online you can monitor what's going on online and all that and if you're not comfortable you can also put it on Airbnb. If you don't want to do the local ones, you can put it on Airbnb. Airbnb, you're also it's just that, okay, now you need somebody to go there to um, think about move out, go back in shape, go, go formalities, for your, which of course you might not be able to do. That's why those companies are there to do it. Yeah, long time payment. Yeah, see, Emma, I don't know if Emma is in Andover. Only by in shape, but long time. Can you your face? She's long time, yeah. So by the way, if you rent you see for two years, to buy me lati wa shemole sole ahead because so 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 yeah. No, no, no. And again, Dubai. Shall you think tenant about one lay? The ba moque tenant one lay so often tenant equi move low lemmy in next year could ja equi come renew in next year for my dad. The ba fair low lay in next year. And money that if you tenant in any notice. So that I should loan next year, then our judging. Nearby year. Nearby year. 
because here you cannot. And also the tenant cannot just decide to move out of your house. If your tenant is not going to renew the next tenancy contract, they need to give you three months notice ahead that I will not be renewing my contract, I'll be moving out. That's for the long term. That's for the long term. So for but the long term- And the company will be in for a long term. Can you push the buyer? Do you charge for managing a rental? Okay. Yes, tenancy contracts is renewed yearly. But like I said, if a tenant comes this year, okay, and the tenant is not going to renew his or her rent next year, before the expiration, three months before the expiration of that contract, the tenant would have sent you the owner an email telling you that he or she is not renewing the rent for the next year, giving you enough time to be able to start putting your, your property now in the market for a new tenant. Because once the tenant gives you three months notice, it means that you can contact your agents and tell them that, okay, my tenant is not renewing. Then they will put the ad, Amatupa, that advertise property, vacant for rent, so that the tenant change judge so to ba di one month ko to jade am a be se viewings because tenant ani di fun permission ko okay yes mo ma wa ni le ni so so and so time then you can come and view then you show it so that as soon as the tenant is moving out you are getting a new tenant for their family hmm Oh, okay. Oh, continue by saying that one lower Okay, you charge for management for clarification. Emma can help with a with with a fall of Emma can help a long term rental, right? Yeah. Okay, now yeah, a long time, a long term. Um, rental, like I said, we will put the thing out for you there. Once all modalities have been put in place and you've collected your keys, you will advertise and then get the tenant into the apartment. So, then even, going, even going for short term, there is another, or uh, there's one of Emma properties on the on the beachfront. That one is only for short term, only for short term. So if you buy on that project, Emma is doing it for you on the short-term basis and it's coming fully furnished, everything, but they are using it only for short-term. In that one, you cannot put a long-term tenant there. It's either you are using it yourself as your home or Emma is handling it as a short-term apartment for you. Only like no, see beachfront. Beachfront yeah. generally is starting from 1.6 million, 1.6 million dirhams, Taba divided by 3.65 Oma Fuani dollar rate. 1.6 million, what's your point? 1.6 million dirhams. If you divide mm -hmm. it by 3.65, okay, which is the dollar for dollar rate, if you divide it by 3.65, what you get will be the price in um, one second I will give you. Thank you. So you get $438,356. Hello, let me. Oh, my dear, $438,356. Oh, my dear, $438,356. Starting new. Starting new. Let me see. He married me value you for me. Yeah, I come for a lot of money. Yes, I did. Just to know. Oh, $130,000. Good. You are on your beach front. You are on your beach long time. Oh. Yes, see any about this side. To buy Rani, if you buy in this particular one, it's called the Beach Isle. If you buy on this project, it's only, it's only for short term. Only for it's either you're using it personally for yourself or you're giving it to Emma to handle as a short-term rental for you. That is the two so options. It's under a program called Holiday Homes by Emma. Mm. 
On on the place, that's one time payment. Which which one? Kini. The beach, uh, the beach eye front arbitration place. No, no, no. I don't think so because any yellow berry is the tenancy contract renewed yearly. Great info. Is that a one time payment? Say one time payment from from rent. Like uh, no, for, for, no, for for the beach front. No, for the beach front, there's a payment plan. Okay, sounds good. Yes, yeah, there's a payment plan. There's a payment plan, but the thing is, one bedroom might not be there right now. We might not have one bedroom anymore, but for other apartments that we get, there's a payment plan. There's a payment plan for beach front. Okay. Anyway, hello, madam. Uh, hello, I'm madam. Is that, hello, madam. Is that $438? Is it for one bedroom or for two bedroom? Um, the, um, the amount I said, because I was giving you a price of 1.7 million dirhams. So 1.7 million dirhams on the beachfront is the starting for one bedroom. And it's just an idea. Community, that is okay, the price. Yeah. Yes. And okay, it's just, thanks. I'm just giving you a rough estimate because see, when you say, okay, I'm ready. I want to buy an apartment. I cannot tell you that this apartment is still available because it's most likely not gone. Let me tell you one thing about Dubai. When a project is launched, okay, the first things that goes are one bedrooms. Before it even becomes one bedrooms, first sells out. Then two bedrooms, okay. Then three bedrooms, you still have a few units. And one thing is the one bedrooms usually are more in number than the two and the three bedrooms. So the two bedrooms, sometimes, okay, you find one or two units left, three bedrooms, you might still find three or four units left, but most times one bedrooms, they sell out. Hmm. Okay. We are so happy to have you here today. Anyway, thank you. I mean, one more, but you are to Shini Berry. Is there anyone, Tony D, Tony Berry, Lati Berry, before we end, Today's chat. So, any other question? You can type out something. Okay, there. thank you so much from OTA. By the way, your company has great reviews. Thank you. Uh, somebody else, Mr. Adeola or Mr. Adeola, I don't know. Please, you're asking a question. I'm ready to get your question. And also, oh. like I said, my name is Ejura Adaji. You guys can check me up on LinkedIn. You can check me on, um, on our website, www.springfield-re.com. The thing is, we are top brokers for MR. We are not MR. Okay, I sell only MR products, but I'm not working in MR. I'm an agent who is registered to work in MR. So yeah. I'm like one of the top brokers for MR. So what we do is we sell you MR project because we are licensed to sell MR and we are yeah. the top brokers in the world. Right. How are you? Yeah. So hello. Good evening, ma. Good evening, ma. Uh, yes. My question goes like this. I, I want to ask about the, you are talking about one bedroom apartment and two bedroom apartment. I want to know, is it like Europe here? Because in Germany, when we talk of yeah, two, a good day, mama. when you talk of two bedroom, they calculate it with sitting room. So I want to know, is it like that in Dubai or the sitting room is not uh, among of the one bedroom or two bedroom? Uh, okay. okay, thank you, Ma. In Dubai, it's like this. You open the door, okay? You come into the living room. Now, and let's say on another side, you have your kitchen. On the mm -hmm. other side of the door, coming inside the apartment, you usually have the guest toilet. Then the, the living room is just there. And then you have two doors, one bedroom, one bedroom. So total, you have like three for the two bedroom. If I understand your question. So you're not having one, the living room is not counted as a bedroom. Yeah. Every one of them, either a two bedroom, three bedroom, one bedroom, all, every one of them has yes. a sitting room. Yes, so they all have the sitting room. So the two bedroom has proper two bedroom and the, most times they're en suite. So you have your two bedroom and your toilet and your bathroom inside. The other room has, and also we always have a maid's room sometimes. So you can have two bedroom plus a maid's room. So what they do is if the main, let's say the master bedroom is, let's say four, four by four by seven to four by three, let's just see. 
Then the other room might be three by, three by seven, 3.7 to let's say 3.6 or 3.5. Now, then the mate room might be two point something by three point something. So you see that it's smaller, but you can put a small single bed inside. It also has its bathroom and its toilet. So you're having two bedroom, you're having a mate room, you're having a living room, you're having your kitchen, you're having your guest toilet. So it's a proper apartment. Hello. How are you? Good to see you. Thank you. Good evening, ma'am. Hello. Okay, you good. Remy, I think you have a question for us. We are listening to you. Okay, the size in the size in square foot for one bedroom usually starts from seven hundred and fifty square foot up until one thousand one hundred square foot depends. If you get an apartment on the podium level, if your apartment is on the podium level, it's usually big because you have a big terrace. So we used to count the terrace and the apartment. So usually those one bedrooms are like 1,000 plus square foot. But normally we start one bedroom from 750 square foot to 1,100 square foot. Depends on what you get, what floor and all that. So you can get one bedroom 750, you can get one bedroom 850, you can get one bedroom 900 square foot, it all depends. So if we put the balcony size with it, it might be 850, the internal area might be 800, you have 50 square foot outside for the, for the balcony, or you want on the podium level, might be 1000 plus, and then you get the internal area for 1000, maybe you get 100 for your terrace, because it usually has big terrace if you're on the podium. Hmm. Ah, we are happy to have you here today. I think we have enough. I don't know, maybe there's anyone that has more questions. Yes. Tebani question, I joined Billy. Can you go to my love? Because uh, we will soon go off of the Zoom now. If any one of us has question, please kindly ask now. Can yes, but, um, I'm not sure if this is a relevant question for you. Um, I was going to ask, do you have an idea of um, how much the charge for rent for a beachfront one bedroom? Yeah, of course. Okay, um, you know, beachfront right now is not ready. Um, we have a comparative, we use other areas around beachfront to compare what the rent is going to be. We've called, we have a place called the Blue Water Island. The Blue Water Island is almost a similar concept to the beachfront, okay? The Blue Water Island is by Miras, is another big developer here, Samai government. And what they are renting one bedroom there is for 150,000 dirhams. Put your calculator, 150,000 dirhams to 180,000 dirhams is the one bedroom there. And the thing is that they don't have the beach access. So they don't have a private beach. If you want to use the beach, you have to go, you have to walk on the, there is a connecting bridge, which is a walk connecting bridge. You walk to the JBR, which is the Jumara Beach Residences to use the public beach. But for beachfront, you've got your private beach. So we are estimating that one bedroom on the beachfront should be more expensive than the blue water, which is giving you 150 for one bedroom. So we're looking at 160, 170 for the beachfront. So if we say 160 approximately, we will get 43,835. For your one bedroom in dollars hmm. yearly right yes yearly that's cool what are going to be very 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 is there any advantage of deciding to be a, a residency over there in Dubai by buying property? Uh, okay, and another thing, Timothy, yes, of course. Um, like I said, Dubai is a safe place. It's one of the safest places right now in the world. I view guys have been following news. You see the way they handle the COVID situation. We mm -hmm. are actually here doing our things normally. The only thing yeah. is that we are all observing. We don't even know there's COVID anywhere. <laughs> we are all observing all the 
COVID protocol. Yeah. We are social distancing. We are using the mask. You know, yeah. I handle the COVID thing so well. Yeah, so so after, yeah, a lot of people now saw that, look, being in Dubai or associating yourself with UAE is an advantage for yourself. And recently also, they've come up with the, um, um, they've come up with the, passports. Now, they are going to be giving their passports, but they are giving it to investors, people who are A's, you know, the scientists, good, well, students who are up there, you know, there's a category that they are giving their, their, their passports to. So they are doing a lot of things now to make it okay for people to uh, want to live in Dubai. And like I said, things here, Dubai is a cosmopolitan city. We've got two, more than 220 nationalities living here. So you're meeting everybody from the world. If you put 10 people together, those 10 people are from different places. So it's like being in Dubai, you're meeting every, people from all over, you know? So you get to see different culture and, and you get to hear different languages. And also the fact that it's a good place to raise kids. You know, there's nothing like um, the liberty people have abroad. You cannot discipline your kids. It's not happening here. Here you can discipline your children. So it's good. It's a place to raise kids that are straight, you know? So um, uh, Dubai is an amazing place. It's a tourist destination. Everybody wants to come here. People want to visit a lot of people saving money to want to come to Dubai for holiday. And the laws here are strict. So people obey, you know, like when there was the lockdown, this place was a ghost town. You will not see anybody outside. There was no police. There was no soldier. There was nobody to tell you go back home. Once immediately they said there was a lockdown, we were all inside the house. So that is how it is with Dubai. We obey the traffic laws. We don't do things like, you know, we need people to chase us. You know, everybody here, everybody here is, is um, what English am I going to use? Everybody here is law abiding we are very law abiding you know so a place where they have laws and people are law abiding you know that that place is a safe place to live okay yeah, minus <laughs> the fact that we have terrible hot weathers some part of the year <laughs> but even with that we're still sleeping with our duvets at night we are still very cold. We still use our jackets in the office, trust me. It's cold inside the house. It's only when you go outside that you know that the weather is terrible. That's the only minus. Because look, no way is perfect. I will tell you the little things we have that is not okay also, which is the weather. And that one is God's hand. Nobody can change it. You know, because of course this place is a dress set like we all know, but every other thing is super is artificially beautiful you know what i mean it's a desert and then from a desert they made this place so beautiful if you've not come here before you need to visit dubai i know and have a look yourself you know it's yeah. somewhere that everybody comes even americans people in the in europe they come here it's a different it's a different thing you know the ball game here is completely different so you know we can all we can only tell you i'm a marketer at the same time i don't just talk to people to come and buy properties or all that or all that i still try to let you know that look you come here have a look at it yourself you will come and you'll fall in love for sure you know yeah. Somebody said, I like your presentation. Very professional. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate yeah. it as well. It is. Thank you. It's very professional. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you. Is there any other question again? I think, um, yeah, that's okay. You did a great job. We love Thank that. You. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much, Ma. Thank you. So for what we learned from you now, if any one of us think, uh, thinking of buying property in Dubai and you would like to stay there, anytime you want. You have to leave it in short time range. That is the best to do if you want to be coming to Dubai anytime you want. So we are happy to have you here today and nice talking to you. Everyone in the house, I hope everyone is okay. Can we end the chat now? I think we are all fine with that. Eshe. Thank you. Thank you very much. Please, Thank everybody, you keep much. safe, keep safe, and mm -hmm. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Thank, Thank you so much. much. Thank you Can so much. Can you like us all the yeah, time? I it. <laughs> so, if anyone needs more information, feel free to contact me. Or maybe you are ready, or you still need more information, feel free to contact me. I will help you out and put you through.
Uh, nice having you guys. Thank you See so you much. Soon. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you. All right. Thank bye. You. Thank you. Bye. Good night. Bye. 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 B